the director of Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 and the upcoming man who's going to be directing Superman Legacy, James Gunn, tackles the big question. Is there superhero fatigue and is it going to hurt the industry? He says, yes, there is superhero fatigue and not really. There's also no superhero fatigue and it's not going to hurt anything. Just so we are clear on this, superhero movies today, and obviously the big bombs notwithstanding, are still doing better than 90% of the other stuff that Hollywood is putting out. So, is there superhero fatigue? Well, James Gunn tackled this in a recent interview, and he says if you really look at it, yeah, I think there is such a thing as superhero fatigue. But he also says... He believes it doesn't have anything to do with superheroes. He says it's the kind of films that they're telling and the type of content that they're in that's really driving consumers. If a film doesn't look that interesting, it doesn't matter if it has a superhero in it or not. People are not going to show up. But if a film looks interesting and people are invested and they want to see more, they're going to show up, superhero or not. And he pointed out some other films out there in regards to, you know, films that drive audiences that are more recently new because they get buzz going, which I agree with him there. And he says he gets what people are saying. There's all this spectacle. They're big spectacle films. Sometimes people get fatigued of that. But at the same time, he says, just look at how good they're doing and look at how much they're driving and saving the industry. So can you really say it's superhero fatigue or is it currently that we're seeing so much content that people are picking and choosing what to watch? And I can kind of agree with him there. Obviously, almost nobody went and saw Shazam! Fury of the Gods. But we see that Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania almost made 500 million, which, you know, back in the day, 500 million was enough to give Iron Man a whole trilogy. So just think about it, right? Like, I get what he's saying, and I kind of agree with him. I think the content and what's in it is going to be more important going forward. You're going to get films that are obviously Superman, Batman, and things like that. But then newer, riskier films, like at one point, which was Guardians and Suicide Squad, will, of course, break through if they're good and people are invested in them. So, yeah, I'm going to agree with him here. Um, It's not all superhero fatigue and it's not really existent but there is a degree of people are being more selective now and i think that's important and certainly i think that's going to continue to be important and then when we get to the next avengers film it's all going to go away because it's avengers people will flock to see it <laughs>